Hi, I'm James Schillingwa for Insider Travel Report. I'm here in Germany and I'm here exploring all the wonderful uh, Altdorf hotels uh, and, and one of them, and I'm going to actually, I'm not there yet because uh, we're at a general manager's meeting of all the Altdorf general managers, uh, but I'm here with uh, Jörg Stricker, who's the general manager of the Altdorf Grand Hotel Schloss Bensberg. And if you know what Schloss is, it is a castle hotel. It's right near Cologne, about 25 minutes outside. We're going to, I'm going to interview Jörg here, and then we're going to go and check it out and see what it's like and see what we're doing there. And you're going to find out about all that on Insider Travel Report. York, first of all, great to meet you here. Uh, uh, nice, and we're going to do kind of a pre-interview. You're going to give me a preview of all the things that I, I, I don't want to miss uh, when, I, when I'm at your hotel. Uh, but let's start with where it is. Uh, where is this hotel? As we said, it's in a, in a, in a castle uh, not too far from Cologne, right? That's correct. That's, uh, Cologne is really uh, popular about the uh, cathedral. That, that the Everybody, most, I've been there many times. Actually, everybody so. knows this. Uh, and the castle, so Hotel Schloss Bensberg, it's around about 25 kilometers from Cologne. So it's not so far. So you could, uh, you could go really quick with the train or with the car from mm. Cologne on. And then you have uh, an amazing castle, a little bit on the mountain, and you have from the terrace, a uh, nice and perfect view to the cathedral in Cologne. Oh, so you can see the cathedral yeah, yeah, from there? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Now, what does the castle date from? What, what year, roughly what year? Yeah, the castle was built in the 17th and... Um, 17th century, yeah. Yeah, century, and, uh, and, uh, but we are a hotel since uh, 2000. So um, the, an insurance, Generali, uh, bought this uh, nice castle and uh, rebuilt this castle, and now since 24 years, uh, we are yeah, at the Alto of Grand Hotel Schloss Bensberg. No, it's great, and you're a five-star luxury hotel. Yeah, it is. There. Yeah. Now, uh, talk about how many accommodate. What's what 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 are your accommodations? How many total keys do you have for the for the hotel? We have uh, 111 keys. So okay. um, last year we had 120, but we built a, a really nice uh, medical center there. Okay. And so um, you could. Took there are some treatments uh, and uh, so it's like a medical medical, yeah, spa, medical spa things center, like that. yeah <laughs> medical spa and uh, yeah, then we have three different restaurants um, we'll talk about the dining yeah, but yeah, so but you have obviously have a wide range of accommodations uh, but they are all beautiful luxury rooms that you've made out of this castle right yeah the uh, the rooms are really special with a really high uh, um, ceiling and um, and um, when when you open the door, you know you are in the castle. So and this is uh, it's really special, and it's uh, totally different to all the hotels which are in the middle of the city. So it's a it's a really nice property with a nice garden around. So um, that, and that, a nice view, of course. And a nice view. Now talk a little. You started talking about the dining. What are the dining options out there? Yeah, we have um, three different restaurants. Uh, the most popular restaurant is the Vendome restaurant. Um, it's a two-star uh, Michelin restaurant. Um, and Mr. Wissler, the chef there, he worked with us uh, over 20 years. So um, he's the, yeah, not the one and only, but a really famous chef in Germany and also in Europe. And um, it's a French kitchen, um, but also with some item from Italy so really um, nice interpretation from from uh, from yeah French and Italian and Mediterranean kitchen so well wow, nice. so it's, it's, it sounds yeah. wonderful and you have two others right yeah then we have an uh, Italian restaurant Enoteca it's a uh, trattoria Enoteca so but it's uh, not pizza and pizza, so it's really a typical original Italian mm -hmm. kitchen, um, also with a really nice uh, Italian uh, wine uh, menu. So we yeah, like that. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so uh, you find a lot of things there. Also nice grappa selection. So okay. it's everything there. What you what you what you need for a good Italian restaurant. Also the interior design. It's uh, really Italian. So it's uh, it's a nice a nice restaurant. Um, and then you have uh, a third one, right? Yeah, and then we have um, a bar restaurant okay. um, 
Salvatore Daliba, so um, oh, that well, means from, from yeah, Bali in, in, in Barcelona, and uh, there is a uh, yeah, Spanish mixed kitchen, but also with the steak and fries concept. And uh, yeah, of course, with a lot of cocktails. Uh, yeah, of course, it's you a need bar, in yeah. a bar. It's <laughs> a bar. So, and in the summertime, uh, you could go out with the restaurants. You have a, neat, a really nice terrace in front of the castle. Uh, with a nice view in the middle of the uh, of the main entrance, and uh, yeah, it's it's a uh, it's a really nice place. Absolutely. Now you mentioned the medical spa, so you do have a big spa facility, right? We have a thousand square meters of spa, uh, five different um, uh, treatment rooms, but um, now we change a little bit with medical treatments. Um, which is really interesting for us and also um, for uh, guests from abroad. It's really interesting because you have really good uh, competencies in terms of medical mm -hmm. um, and then mix with good treatments. Um, that sounds good for the future. Yeah. Now, what do your guests do uh, while they're at the hotel? I mean, it's not too far from Cologne. Uh, you, you said you can see the cathedral. Yeah, yeah. Uh, but what, what exactly are the activities they engage in uh, when, they're, when they're staying with you? Yeah, we, when you take a view to Cologne, you have the big city and behind you have um, a lot of forest and you have a lot of uh, opportunities for good adventure things, e-biking, uh, hiking, uh, but also uh, a lot of nice place. You, you, could, you could see small uh, villages, uh, also with old buildings, mm -hmm. so it's really tra traditional there. Um, most of the guests um, which come over the weekend to take a day in Cologne, um, then a half day in a spa and then they make a tour around the castle or spend some time um, yeah, in our bars and restaurants, um, yeah, which is also nice to come a little bit down. And how, how roughly how, how long do people stay, do guests stay with you? Two days, three days, what? Yeah, yeah we have in the week from Monday to Tuesday, we have, uh, we are, we have a lot of business, so also so conferences, yeah, yeah, conferences, so. and uh, from uh, Friday on, we have uh, the leisure guests, uh, which uh, stay with us over the weekend. Mm -hmm. um, some older guests, which has more time, also a little bit longer. But with the medical center, we will change it a little bit so that we have also guests. I don't know for three to f five, six, seven mm -hmm. days. Um, uh, depends how long of the treatment. No, that's fantastic. And so, again, it, it, you know, this, this hotel that we're here, we're at the uh, uh, Altof, uh, uh, remind me, because the, wh where are we now? We're at the, oh, yeah, the Altof Grand Hotel. The, the, this yeah. one here, this one here, this, yeah. this hotel. Yeah, uh, that's the Uberfahrt. The, the Uberfahrt, yeah, Uber Uber I got to remember these names. Yeah. Uh, and this is a great place if you're going, in, you know, in between places. It actually would be good for a river cruise. A lot of Americans take river cruises for this one. And yours is the same way. Cologne is a big river cruise stop. Yeah, uh, and is, if yeah. you want to get off and go to your hotel, it would be a fantastic Absolutely. way. Uh, you get, get wonderful food, get the spa treatments and everything else. So, again, it's sort of an affiliated if you're looking for something for your upscale clients to really enjoy off of a river cruise and enjoy Germany a little yeah. bit, right? Absolutely, because from Cologne on, uh, you will go with the boat to Koblenz. So this um, are around 80 kilometers. It's a really nice uh, uh, way and, and opportunity to see a lot of castles on the right and left and side from the Rhine River. And a lot of uh, boats make stop in Cologne. And then we have some groups already in the hotel, uh, which stay with us for a day or two. Uh, well, if you okay. want to explore these castles, you see them from the river. I've done that cruise many yeah. times over the years, but I've never actually gone in the castles because yeah, so. you're just seeing, you're going by it. So it's a way you can actually go to the castles. And of course, you're getting a, a, a second Altof, I believe, uh, in, in Cologne yeah. too, yeah. next year or something. Yeah, we will open this hotel uh, in May 25. So okay. this is really the neighbor of the cathedral. So it's, I don't know. 50 meters from the cathedral. Okay. It's, re it's a really so you can see the place. you can yeah. see the the, yeah. the the cathedral from afar. Yeah, you at your can, castle. You can or you put your really hand on. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's 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 really special. This hotel, really traditional building, one of the oldest hotel in Europe, wow. uh, and um, yeah, um, with a lot of history and uh, everybody. It's really happy that we will open this hotel uh, hopefully in May next year. Fantastic. Yeah. Now, uh, as I said, we go out to about 125,000 travel advisors in the U.S. Anything you'd like to tell them about your property that maybe they didn't know? I mean, they don't may not know about the property first off, but anything you'd like to tell them? Yeah, we sometimes we have uh, American guests, and all the American like the style from the hotel. So it is a castle. It's it is a castle. It is a castle. And and. Uh, and uh, 
but it's a good interpretation from a castle. It's from, from, from the hardware, really historical, but when you are in the hotel, you have really cool food concepts, you have uh, uh, good bars, you, you have uh, all the nature around, so it's a really good stop, and I hope I will see you next time. Absolutely. Now, where can they go to find out more information about it? I know you've got uh, altoffhotels.com, and I yeah. believe you're also Altoff Collection, right? Yes, 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 that's correct. Yeah, Those are the two. Jorge, thank you. It's been wonderful to meet you here. I'm glad you got all the general managers here. We can get them all at once. Although, I'm, as I said, I have to go experiencing your hotel now. You won't be there, maybe, because yeah. I, uh, maybe at the end you'll so see me. Because I, I, I will see you next week. Next week, yeah. we will see and me. Then, and then uh, we could go deeper in, and then I will show you the hotel in detail. I'll, I'll, I'll be looking yeah. forward to it. And then yeah. you're going to have to live up all, all the things you told me that have to be right. Now. Yeah. <laughs> so, yeah. Anyway, great to, to meet you here, and we'll see you again very soon in the next few days. And it sounds like a marvelous hotel i can't wait to stay in the castle yeah I, I i hope that you will come next week and i'm happy that to that i meet your person there yeah fantastic i'm james Schillinglaw, and this is insider travel report